Now from Place Ministries, another inspirational moment. Welcome back to Your Place. Galatians 4.9 says this, But now that you have come to know God, or rather to be known by God, how can you turn back again to the weak and worthless elementary principles of the world whose slaves you want to be once more? Some people might look at my life and say I've been privileged to know and in many cases be known by many high profile individuals in many different professions. Well, it dawned on me reading Galatians 4.9, whether I'm privileged or not based on who I know and who knows me, that those I know cannot give me a peace that surpasses all understanding. Those I know cannot give me an assurance that they know what the future holds for me. Those I know cannot forgive my sins. Those I know cannot assure me because of me knowing them and them knowing me that I'll spend eternity in heaven. But there is one who knows me and I know him that can give peace, does know my future, has forgiven my sins and assured me that I'll go to heaven because I know him personally and he knows me personally. And his name is God. God the Father, God the Son, Jesus Christ, and God the Holy Spirit. In living out your place in life and ministry, consider yourself privileged if you know God and he knows you personally. And if you don't know God personally, today would be a great day for you to come to know him personally. And yes, I would consider it a privilege to help introduce you to him personally if you don't know him. Your Place is a weekday devotional from Place Ministries. Our focus is helping followers of Christ know how and why God created them and be encouraged to do what God created them to do in life and ministry. For a list of free resources, go to placeministries.org and join us every weekday right here at Your Place.